That was awful. I can't stand the whole bar scene. Hey, it was your first night out there. You'll find the right one soon. Well, how will I know it's the right one? Oh, you'll know. When you find the one, you just know. You seem awfully knowledgeable about all this. Have you ever... Well, I served in the war. There was a space war? Space war? No, no, I fought for the Viet Cong in the late 60s. I have told you that story, right? Well, the end of it is we won. Steve, what are you doing? Drinking beer in my underwear. Put that down and go put on some clothes this instant. Or you can shut up! Ah, oh, this is a little uncomfortable. There we are. I'm your father. You can't talk to me that way. Yeah? What you gonna do? Kill me? <gasps> Maybe Steve is your one. I can't kill my own son. Yeah, that's what I thought. Now I refer you back to my previous statement. Shut up! Get the door! Boy, he is rough on you. He is elephant making love to a cat rough on you. Hi, sorry to disturb you. My name's Randy. I just moved in with my mom down the street. I'm throwing empties at your head! I was recently released from prison, and the law requires me to tell everyone within a two-mile radius that I'm a registered sex offender. I threw peanuts at you! I used to work over at the water park where I molested a ton of kids, but now I'm out, so we'll see what happens. Sorry, my mind's a million miles away. Now, what are you selling? Hey, shut the door! You're letting all the air out! So smooth. Can I come in? I would very much like to come in. I would like to be in your home. Chicken strips on a TV tray in five minutes, or I'm kicking your ass! Hey, killer. How was the kill? You need to wash the blood off your hands? Oh, better yet, don't. Well, I didn't actually kill anyone. I tried to... You know what? I'm tired. I have a headache. I have a lot of work to do. My back hurts. It's that time of the month. I have an early meeting. That's my pencil sharpener. Just... Sharpening my pencils for my meeting tomorrow. All right, Stan, now don't be nervous. This place is a sure thing. I'm gonna do it this time, guys. Good. Now, if you start to get nervous, picture them naked. You start to get really nervous, make them get naked. Still nervous, you get naked. You can do whatever you want. You're killing these people. Oh, good. You're here. Come on in. We're in a bit of a hurry. We have to catch a comet. Now, according to the laws of Zargon, we need an outsider to deliver the poison which will return us to our home planet. And you must be the chosen one, since you were the first to reply to our post on Craigslist. How awesome is Craigslist? That's how I met my hiking buddy, and that bitch who stole all my stuff. Okay, now, which one of you will be releasing us to freedom? Our boy Stan, right here. Is there a problem? What are you waiting for? Hurry up! Is this the first time you've poisoned a bunch of people? Come on, do it, do it, do it! Uh, uh, right now is my acting class. I'm letting down my scene partner. So, I like your shower caps. Sells crazy right away. There you are. I've been calling your cell all morning. I got you a part in a snuff film. You'll be killing Stacy Keach. Oh, uh, what is this? I, I don't get this. I was picking blueberries for peace with my daughter. Who was I kidding? I'm just a wimpy non-killer who doesn't have the guts to end another human's life. I'll set up the juicer so we can make empathy smoothies. Yay. I see you've noticed our unitards. We're trying out for gymnastics. That's right. I'm defying you with a handspring. Good luck. Wish me luck on bottling my own preserves. My blueberries. Look at yourself. Look at what you've become. You're not going to find the one picking blueberries. Give it up, Roger. There is no one. That person doesn't exist. No one is just going to magically fall in my lap. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. The guy who came to my house. This whole time, I was going out looking for it when it was right down the street, living with its mother and watching The Sandlot on DVD. Uh, Stan? It was right there, and I couldn't even see it. Stan? I guess that's why it's perfect. You don't even realize it's happening. Stan! The... What? Steve just rode away in that pedophile's ice cream truck. Oh, my God. He had ice cream at lunch. <laughs> Are you Randy's mother? I need to find your son. He drove off with my boy. Oh, dear. Randy used to work at the water park before the troubles. You might want to check there. 
He also kills cats! So, uh, you know. What an awesome place! Thanks for bringing us, Randy. No problem. Hey, do you kids sometimes kiss your pillow and pretend it's one of the little rascals? Uh, no. <laughs> Me neither. How'd you boys like to see the old mattress in my secret spy lair behind the waterfall? Yeah! I need a ticket, quickly! My son is about to be molested! Sixty-five dollars. Sixty-five? That's outrageous! If you have a soda can, you get in for half price. My son's still about to be molested. I need a half-price ticket. I'm sorry. I can't accept a full can. It has to be empty. <laughs> Polar bears shouldn't give this to their babies. All right, clear a path. Some people work for a living. Uh, 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 you guys need tickets. CIA. Wow, that bums me out. Perry Ellis, wallet owner, out of my way. Chili told us what happened. We got here as soon as we could. Spread out and find the boys. There's not a moment to lose. Sanchez Montezuma, INS, Chero and Sopapilla Division. I'm confiscating all these churros. And a milk, please. See? Isn't playing popcorn fun? Something doesn't seem right here. Yeah, at the very least, we should have popped by now. I'm the salt. All colonels have to wrestle me to get salted. <laughs> Freeze, dirtbag! Dad! It's all over, Randy. Time to die. Okay, yeah. I get it. Uh, aren't you... aren't you gonna apologize and beg for your life? No. Look, I'm a sex offender. I love offensive sex. I offend people with the sex I have. That's who I am, and that's who I'll always be. My God, boys. We can all take a page from Randy the Molester's book. He's comfortable with who he is. And I should be as well. So I'm not a killer. If it happens for me and I kill someone, great. If not, fine. But it's not going to be what defines me. I don't need to kill someone to prove anything to you, myself, or anyone else. Thanks for saving us. I'm sorry for the way I acted. Just because you haven't killed anyone doesn't mean you're not a great dad. You're going away for a long time, Randy. Not as long as you might think. What do you mean? Well, I've got a great lawyer and my mom's got a ton of money. I'll be back out on the streets in no time. I don't think so. Once again, Bad Larry, I am so sorry. I can't believe you fired a shot that completely missed Randy and went through the waterfall hitting Bad Larry, who was on the other side. What? I'm just trying to make sure we're all clear. Oh, uh, I'm not gonna make it. See, Stan? It was me all along. I was your one, and you didn't even know it. Bad, Larry. Hey, hey, no tears, you. I am one bad, bad Larry. <coughs> I'll never forget you, bad Larry. You'll always be my first. I'm, I'm glad it was me. And I shall become more... Powerful than you could possibly imagine. Uh. What do you mean by that? Eh, who cares? He's dead. I know it's just a corn dog, but you'll never forget it. Where did I park my car? Daddy! You're just in time to go with me to pick raspberries for justice. Go to hell, Haley. That's not who I am. Now, go take off that unitard or I'll kill you. You so would. Did you kill someone? Yep. Did you wash the blood off your hands? I sure didn't, honey. I sure didn't. <laughs> <gasps> Here it is, my big chance. Last line of the show. Oh, uh, I've got an area. Uh, something about uh, Radger Hauer. Uh, no, no, no. Wait, wait, wait. No! No Fox Local News! No! You know, there's been a lot of talk lately about homosexuals, but how do you know what to believe? Well, here are a few tips that may help you tell when you've got a gay.
So, uh, what's your favorite Madonna album? I like her early work. If his answer is anything but, I've never bought one, you've got a gay. Let's take a blood sample, Mr. Braga. If instead...